Hello, this is Finny and Tirosol, and I'm making my first video for this channel, and I hope there shall be many more. Anyway, uh, I'm going to start off uh, with a video of CRPG, which is a multiplayer mod for the game Mount and Blade Warband. Uh, not very well heard of, at least where I'm from, but I've stuck with this game for years since it came out, and uh, it's a really good experience. Uh, Alright, we're going to head to the lobby, um, and I think we're going to start off with the CRPG mode, Defend the Virgin. Uh, don't worry, this is not about to get... Uh, rated R or exceed PG-13. Uh, we simply have to defend a innocent lady from oncoming waves of... Well, I'm not quite sure what they are. They're, they have names, but that does... They... Such as peasants, but they don't seem to... Uh, resemble peasants when they take a nice whack at you. Alright, I'm going to go with a Morion helmet and black armor, which is actually Landschnicht, however you want to say it, uh, German mercenary armor. Um, and I'm going to be using a Flamberge. If you don't know what a Flamberge is, you're about to find out. And that guy went down Boromir style. This is, if you're unfamiliar with CRPG and the Defend the Virgin mode, you and other players, such as this guy, this defend. This, where is she? There she is. Her from the oncoming waves of bots. Alright, uh, the new wave has started, and I believe we're going to be facing nomads. I'm going to hang back a little bit so as not to get couch lanced or jousted, as some of you might say. Oh yeah, that that's a uh, flamberge. You don't want to get hit by that thing or stabbed. That right there is seemingly a noob. That's a oh, uh, I, I'm mistaken. Apparently, the uh, last for those of you who might be watching that uh, are familiar with CRPG, I have 164 weapon proficiency and two-handed. Uh, well, here. You can look at that. That's my build and everything. Next wave of peasants. <laughs> this uh, armor is doing pretty well there. and got a kill for himself. And I'm going to let that brilliantly minded warrior take out that peasant and now he sh is probably going to get mugged. Well, he's That's 
called footwork. Uh, fallen Sianta Sajanta wisely came back and just saved the uh, virgin over there from a sneaky peasant that got by. Kudos to you, fallen Sianta. I'm gonna pronounce that as Hispanic. All right, we've defeated all three waves of peasants. Now we're moving on to the bandits. You may have caught a glimpse of them earlier. Uh, that guy's new, I think. Sovngarde. Thumbs up to him, S fellow Skyrim player. Who's this? So, let's enjoy the freedom of spectator mode. Can we get some, uh... We've got a nice helicopter panning here. Can we get some music for the high hour chore? No. Pixelated tree foliage. Bandit joined to get to the Virgin. He is fallen by a guy in the orange outfit. Or G I R L. Perhaps. Zenith. Slice. And if if you find this commentary atrociously. Boring, and you are becoming somnolent. Forgive me. I hope to become better. Uh, as I said, I don't believe I've uh, done it before, but a few years ago. That guy just took him all to the face and threw his shield. Yeah, that's a fire of each other. Series of waves of sorts. And this is the bandits. Bandits have won. All right, well, we're gonna try one more on this map. Let's go for a. Uh, we'll play as the uh, Dark Knight, the Black Knight from Monty Python, and a server glitched us out. Well. I think that's the server telling us that we need to wrap up this video. Um, I hope you'll be watching the next. This is Finian Tiersel's first video, and farewell.